I have. I've found one of the bigger warthogs that we have out here. This is a rather large male. He doesn't look that large because he's kneeling down at the moment and doing that typical warthog feeding pattern that they do that is so comical where they sit on their front legs and feed and use that big disc-like snout to be able to get lower to the ground and dig up any little roots and tubers that there might be. But I can tell you that he is massive. To give you an idea of how big he is, I would say that he's easily... Oof, uh, maybe not lengthwise, but in terms of bulk, the size of a female leopard. He's massive. He's got a big bulky front section and thick head and neck. And it's difficult to get a size sort of comparison with him and another animal. But in terms of dogs, I would say a very, very large mastiff would be a good way to think about it. Just not as long a legs. But body size and thickness is quite large. So... He's a big guy and he's very relaxed. Generally, the warthogs around tend to just get up and go when we come along. But you can see this guy hasn't even gotten onto his front legs. So he's very chilled with us. And the reason why we know he's a male is, well, not only because of his size, but you see he's got very large warts on his face. So those big ones around the eyes and then another set protruding from the middle of the face between the eyes and the tusks themselves now those warts on a female is very 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 rare to find that middle set of warts on a female it does happen in fact james actually found one here on juma but they definitely won't be as pronounced as what you see there brian you're asking if a warthog would eat meat well brian they're not really they're not designed to eat meat and it's there are reported cases of warthogs going up to carcasses and sniffing around and picking up bits and whether or not they actually consume chunks of the meat is debatable there's also been circumstances where i've seen them actually go to a carcass and feed off the rumen that was inside the carcass itself so it looked as though they were eating parts of the carcass but they weren't they were feeding off balls of grass that were still stuck in the digestive tract of that particular carcass which is quite an interesting way of doing things but i have never personally seen a warthog eating any chunks of meat or any sort of protein like that you see it in bush pigs which is one of their cousins that we get out here very seldom in the sabi sands but there are lots of bush pigs towards the drakensberg mountains on our western side but these guys theoretically no they're mostly are herbivorous you'll find that the others are omnivores like normal domestic pigs but these guys not so much now you can see when he stands up against the termite mound he's quite large he's a serious individual this guy <laughs> 